That's cool, girl. I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat. Friend, I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither, but seeing I do just fine. You want to step outside or do a business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. Oh, uh, how's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? I can't, partners. <laughs> I don't mean to spoil your fun, but I got things to do. You sure? Quite sure. I got to get him out of here. Come on, Reverend, let's get you home. Where'd he go? I don't know. I was talking to you. <sighs> Gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, <laughs> smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. I look kind of crazy, mister. Swanson! What are you doing? Come on, right. Get your hands what off him. Say to me? I didn't say a word. You'll keep. You stay out of it! Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch! What the hell is your problem? He's with me! Oh my god! You killed him! I'm gonna keep the law on you! You're a fine man, Arthur! Damn it, Reverend! Hey, you! Get back here! You better stop right there. Stay away from me. Stop, you son of a bitch. Stop, or I'll kill you. I swear. Here. I said stop, damn it. Okay, okay. Tell anyone what you saw back there? You're a dead man. You understand me? Yep. I I won't tell us so. I promise. Good. Get the hell out of here. Reverend, get off the damn tracks! Just a simple mistake. 
you can still be saved. Huh? What have you done with your foot? It appears to like this place and wants to stay. Get your foot out of here! Twist your leg, you drunken bastard! Help! Help me or we're both dead! to like this place and wants to stay. Get your foot out of here! Twist your leg, you drunken bastard! Get it! Come on! <laughs> 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 You. What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <sighs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But... <laughs> uh, what are you mumbling about now? Better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Uh, uh, oh, what happened? Just the usual. Poor uh, bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky.
Let's go, girl. with the holler. Oh, I got bit. Oh, God. Oh, oh, I need medicine or a siphon. Here, oh, drink this. Oh, 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 medicine? Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, oh, you saved my life. I owe you. Got that right. I do. Oh. Uh. Now I, I gotta get out of here. No! Oh. Oh. There's no much like it around here no more. Yeah.
How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? Just I... keep your eyes. <clears throat> Where is that little Irish bastard? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the Blackwater to see how things lie? The place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Well, he got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. Well, they wanna trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And then we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure, well, we'll rescue Sean and we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Long time, girl. Follow me. Let's see if we can track down this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yes, south of the river West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. Down there. Reckon those might be our boys. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, we should keep it down. Indeed. Let's go. Stay with them. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. Pick up the pace a bit. 
Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. Sure. All right. Let's take a closer look. Binoculars, gentlemen. these bounty hunters. I don't know too much about Ike Skeldon's boys, but I hear they're a big crew, and wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking them up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Quietly, if we can. Leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Crouch down out of sight. Take out your knife. Stay here. Halfway up the canyon to deal with. Come on! We need to get past these sons of bitches! Vamos!
Camp's up this way. Come on. I'll take the left side, Charles. You go right, okay? Goddamn army of these bastards. How much is Sharks bound? Maybe we should turn them in ourselves. Still time. Less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. <laughs> Do we get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. <laughs> I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Have I got stories for you? Yeah, I can't wait. <clears throat> I imagine y'all miss me a lot, but fear not, the joy's back in your lives now.
just wanted to say, I know you bastards missed me. <laughs> Even you, Arthur. You Even are. you. Well, Arthur. Oh, Arthur. Hey, you seem in a good mood. I am, son. I am. Let's have some fun. Tonight. Let's enjoy ourselves. Are we having a party? Maybe. Just a little one. Great. And you get a bump on the head. Mr. McGuire is back. And don't you worry, Mr. Pearson, you drunk old shitbag. It'll be nothing but the, the finest game in the pot. Now, Deadeye Maguire's back. <laughs> and don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp running like clockwork. <laughs> I love you, bastards. <laughs> have fun. Have lots of fun. <laughs> I suppose. You're looking lovely as ever, if I may say so. Oh, stop it. Imagine riding with him all the way from Blackwater to here. Mr. McGuire. Oh, stupid. Oh. So, what now? something and 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 it taught me something I will never forget and that's that most fellas are sheep that's right and and if you can tell the difference between a you, the difference between a sheep and a, a, a sheep and, and a man then you well you, that, you, that makes you a better man than me sir and that's all I'm saying. Mark my words. All of you, mark my words.
up again. Fine. Yeah, it's good to have him back. Let's see if we're still saying that in a day or two. How are you doing, Mrs. Adler? <sighs> Not really in the party mood. I understand. Well, I can't think of anything else to say. All right, Arthur. You okay, Jose? Well done, Arthur. Well, it wasn't just me. Will you dance with me, Arthur? <gasps> sure. I ain't much of a dancer. See, Arthur? It's okay to dance. It doesn't mean we won't stop thinking you're angry and sad. That what you think of me? <laughs> sad in a good way, like a romantic poet. Well, that's about all I can muster. I'm not quite sure. Oh. This keeps happening. Yep, and all right. Look after your boy tonight. He's not my boy. Okay, okay. A classic Sean McGuire speech. Yes, he's definitely back. You okay, Tilly? <laughs> yes, just relaxing. So good to have Sean back. Yeah, well, you say that now. All right, well, I should be getting on. Do you, do you remember that mine? <laughs> of course. And then, oh, that nauseating popping jam wow. in that funky sound. As loud a mouth as this.